This is the shit! Well, okay, not the shit, that was the first film, but this is, uh, 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 adequately satisfying! So it starts off like there's Decepticons all over the world and we have to find them. Boom, that crane thing looks odd. Well, uh, 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 boom, Transformer! <laughs> but it's okay, because the truck is there and he's like, <laughs> and it's Optimus Prime! God damn, it's so good to see Optimus Prime again! And not only that, there's all new Transformers that are there as well! Like Sideswipe, who I think only has two lines, RC, who I think only has one line, and Jolt, who I don't think ever talks at all. That's pretty weak. But the twins are there, and they're hilarious! Yo, man, how are we gonna go do that? <laughs> I have no idea what they're saying. So the kid from before, he's going off to college. And his girlfriend says, Say you love me. Say you love me. No, you say you love me. No, you say you love me. Let's just compromise and say we're both a-holes. Cool. So this kid comes across another kid who thinks the Transformers are real. And I'm like, well, wait a minute. How can they not think they're real? They have like this huge battle in the opening. But it's okay, because it turns out that's all covered up. Yeah, uh, the first film too. That huge epic battle in the city where, you know, thousands of people were watching. Yeah, that's, that's all covered up. Pretty late. But the Decepticons resurrect Megatron! Woo! And it turns out he's being controlled by the evil fallen. Who put a secret language in the kid's head? So the kid's like, <laughs> And so the evil Decepticons want to get what's in his head! So they send in this really pretty Decepticon to open his mind! Only it's not a real Decepticon, it's like a, a college girl! It's a Decepticon slut! So Optimus Prime comes to save the day! And he battles Megatron! <laughs> Some shit like that. Who cares? Shit blows up. Boom, boom, boom. <laughs> so the Fallen get on all the TVs in the world, and they're like, Hand over the kid or your dog meat, and I'll get you next time. Catch it. And all the people in the world are like, Holy shit, aliens are real. And the government is like, It's okay, we'll cover it up. Oh, okay. So they get to the pyramids, where apparently this machine can bring Optimus Prime back to life, and this super big kick asthmatron pops up. It's like five Transformers in one. Holy shit. God, it's so cool! So I'm like, oh my god, what the hell is this thing gonna do? And he's only on the screen for like two minutes. Weak. So we got some people firing in the desert, and... Firing in the desert, and then... Firing in the desert! But then, the kid dies! <gasps> no! Actually, that's not too bad. But then the kid goes to robot heaven! I'm totally not kidding! Robot heaven, where all the other primes are there and they give him back his life! Week. So the kid comes back to life and he tries to use the machine to bring back Optimus while they fire in the desert! So the kid uses the machine, rejuvenates Prime, and he's resurrected! I died for your sins. <laughs> you sure did. But then the Fallen come and take control of the machine. They're gonna use it to blast out the sun! So they all continue... Everyone firing in, in the, the desert. desert! But then Jetfire is like, Take my parts, Optimus, I'm old and annoying! And Optimus Prime says, Okay. <laughs> and Prime becomes super out the motherfucking Prime! And he kicks ass! More major acid! So he goes up against the Fallen and Megatron, and it's over in like a minute. It's like, <laughs> done. Weak. So yeah, the climax is a bit of a cock tease, but uh, aside from that, it was great! Thumbs up! Five stars! Greatest adequately satisfying movie of all time! And I liked it, too. I'm a nostalgia critic, I remember it, so you don't have to. Dude, did he just do my act? <laughs>